Weekend because of that windstorm cleaning up after trees blew down on cars Saturday night. A core Harlan shows us the damage one tree did to a Tualatin woman's car. That's my husband's um, hat right there. Right, oh, that is? right there, uh -huh. with the leather. Uh -huh. This woman who did not want her face seen on TV was watching a movie Saturday night when the big wind blew through her to wall at an apartment complex. She was so involved in the movie she didn't hear anything that indicated to her that there was a problem, but her mother did hear the tree fall and she knew almost immediately something was wrong. She was in her room. She said, I heard the alarm, alarm the car alarm was going off and everybody's outside. You should go out there and check. At first, I didn't think of anything. I didn't think of a tree was coming down. It did come down right on top of what this woman calls her pride and joy. The car that her husband bought for her smashed right down the center by the weight of a 30-year-old fir tree. Around the same time at the Willow Tree Apartments on Beaverton Hillsdale Highway, wind blew over a 30-foot fir tree that blocked the entryway to the apartment complex sometime after 1 a.m. Sunday morning. It's a good news, bad news situation in some respects. The tree did crush the woman's car and several others parked right next to it. Fortunately, though, no one was in the cars and the same wind blowing from a slightly different direction could have blown the tree over onto an apartment building. Her car's insured, she says, and she will use mom's minivan for now after a short but intense Saturday night burst of wind changed the landscape of this Tualatin apartment complex forever. Core Harlan, Coin 6 News.